Well, certainly a hot topic for years in our state. We're talking about legalizing recreational marijuana. Thanks for staying with WJZ tonight. I'm Rick Ritter. And I'm Nicole Baker. A brand new Goucher poll shows that most of you here in Maryland do support making marijuana legal. And WJZ Live at 530 tonight. Our Rachel Cardin is going to break down these new numbers along with some new reaction for us. Rachel. That's right, Rick and Nicole. So about that reaction, almost everyone we spoke to today say that they think marijuana helps with things like insomnia, anxiety, as well as pain relief. But we did speak to a few people who thought that legalizing a drug could send the wrong message. Okay, so if you had to vote on this, legalize it or not legalize it, what would you vote? I think it absolutely should be and I think it's long overdue. For me personally, I would say no just because I don't do it. Marylanders are weighing in. Should marijuana be legalized for recreational use? A recent Goucher poll shows 60% of the state thinks it should be. I think that year after year we've seen a majority of support for, for cannabis legalization in Maryland. But the topic has yet to be voted on in the General Assembly. If it were to come to a vote, Malia Cromer, director for the Center of Politics at Goucher College, thinks it would pass. We know that both the presiding officers of the Senate as well as the House are supporting moving forward with the legalization of recreational cannabis. The economic benefit is what advocacy groups are focused on. This is creating hundreds of thousands of dollars in tax revenue in other states, and Maryland has um, the same opportunity to benefit from uh, the economic boost of legalizing cannabis. And residents agree. If like the black market is going to make money, why wouldn't you want the state to get money to use it for? All kinds of things because it'll bring in a ton of money, a ton of jobs. But some worry about the younger generation. For some people, it's for it's, it's like a gateway. It's a gateway drug. Because marijuana is a drug not currently accepted for medical use, research shows legalizing marijuana would cut down on the inequities in the arrests of minorities. Maryland Speaker of the House did recently say that she's making this topic a priority when the session resumes in 2022, but again, it could take some time before it's actually voted on. We're live in Towson. I'm Rachel Curtin for WJZ.